This video has been brought to you by the EA Creator Network. They gave me a free key, so thank you very much to Codemasters and EA for uh, allowing me to preview this game ahead of release. I played the F1 2022 Grand Prix, a five race short duration Grand Prix. This is the very first race on the track. Let me tell you, I had previously done time trials. After getting used to the Miami track and time trials, I decided, you know, I'll, I'll do a five race Grand Prix. Uh, let me tell you something, the difference between the time trials and the Grand Prix, it, it's like night and day. Seriously, dry track with extra cars on the track, so, so difficult. I play a very aggressive racing style, which is why I don't play with other people. Um, you'll see here, I, I run into the other players a lot, and it's just because I'm, I'm super aggressive when I play. But the game itself, this is on ultra high settings uh, with RTX ray tracing enabled. And you can see here, the graphics quality is phenomenal. It is absolute spot on gorgeous graphics. The cars, the graphics on the cars especially, beautiful. You can see all of the reflections there uh, in the wheel, uh, on the, the car frames, on the wheels there especially. Uh, just absolutely, absolutely beautiful. I found in this first race, I found it really difficult to concentrate on exactly what I was doing and, and what I was meant to be doing. Specifically because of, I, I just wanted to look around. I wanted the scenery, you know, I wanted to see the scenery and, and look at everything. So a little bit of information about F122. The release date is July 1st, 2022 on PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S, Xbox One, and PC via the EA app, Origin, Steam, and the Epic Store. You can start racing three days earlier from June 28th, 2022 if you pre-order the F122 Champions Edition which will set you back, I believe, about 70 British pounds if you're in the UK. What's new in this game? What can you expect? F1 sports stunning new cars and a new handling model that recreates the intense wheel-to-wheel -wheel racing that's had us on the edge of our seats so far in the 2022 Formula One season. You can test your talent amongst the iconic Florida palm trees around the 19 challenging corners of the vibrant new Miami International Autodrome and go flat out as F1 Sprint comes to the game for the first time in F1 2022. There are going to be new race options in F1 2022, which will give you more control over your virtual F1 race day with the opportunity to choose between immersive and broadcast style formation laps, safety car periods, and pit stops. And yes, you can also drive the safety car in certain modes of the game. F1 2022 also includes VR compatibility on PC via the Oculus Rift and the HTC Vive to give you the ultimate immersive F1 experience. And I personally have not tried this on VR yet, but I've seen videos of people who have tried it. And let me tell you, according to them, it is seriously awesome. It is the best thing that they have ever played on VR. They say that the immersion just skyrockets. So if you've got uh, an Oculus Rift or an HTC Vive, and, and I, I would highly, highly recommend that you try this game in VR. You can also get a taste of the glitz and glamour of Formula One and F1 Life, which is a new space for players to unlock and show off supercars, clothing, accessories, and more for the world to see. This is the thing that I'm really interested in about this game. Um, you can buy furniture to, to deck out your pad with, unlock supercars, and put them in a special, special garage that, that shows off those supercars. Um, you can tailor the supercars to your taste, paint jobs, decals. It's, it's seriously, it's seriously going to be awesome. But with all these new features, you, you may ask, well, what about 
these features in, in F1 2021 that I really liked. Well, my team in career mode are going to be returning to F1 2022 with fresh new features along with two player split screen, online multiplayer, and all the other features that you know and love. F122 is available to pre-order right now with a special Miami themed content pack featuring livery, suit, helmets, gloves, a cap, t-shirt, and wall art designed by a local artist when you pre-order the game before the 16th of May. The F1 2022 Champions Edition also gets you on the track early with three days early access, meaning you can play starting June 28th. Uh, with that, that pre-order, you will get an F1 2022 New Era content, an F1 Life Starter Pack, my, uh, new My Team icons, and 18,000 pit coin, uh, which is the in-game currency that you use to uh, to purchase things for the new F1 Life. If you want to be up to date with all of the latest news, you can go over to the Formula One game website, which is ea.com games F1 2022. I will link everything down below, by the way, in the video description. Uh, you can also follow the official Twitter account and Instagram account, YouTube and their Facebook. They can be found on Twitter, uh, twitter.com slash Formula One Game, YouTube, um, and Facebook under Formula One Game as well. Again, I will link all of those in the description below. I'm really excited for this game, to be completely honest. It is so shiny and so gorgeous. It really, really is. Thank you so, so much for tuning in, watching this video. If you have any questions, please ask them below in the comments. And also, if you like the video, please like it, thumbs up, and remember to subscribe for more videos. I'll see you all later. Bye for now.